Hello friends. In this video, let us understand how to create a thermometer graph. This graph is also called as bullet graph. To compare targets versus actuals in a compact form, we can use thermometer graph. So first of all, let us understand or let us see how a thermometer graph looks like through this learning module what we have here. And then we can discuss how to create a thermometer graph through a normal process in Excel. Now let us uh, select advanced button and press it so that the module is in front of us and there is an alert about uh, discussing how to use this uh, advanced excel charts training module please read that I am directly jumping into thermometer graph option but you can go one by one so I need to select a range so there is a dedicated uh, data point for each type of graph so for this the data for thermometer graph need to be selected so this data is talking about the target versus actual comparison uh, in the month of april and may and press ok so the graph is appearing now so that is why now we can understand why we are calling it as a thermometer graph the graph is showing uh, two bars overlapping each other the pale uh, bar is uh, depicting the target and the dark bar is the dark blue bar is talking about actual so the mercury level is not beyond the target so obviously the achievement is uh, less than the target so that that is why we are calling it as thermometer graph now let us see how to create this uh, thermometer graph in excel in the normal process Select the range, insert, go to graphs option, select a normal clustered column graph, select target data series, format data series, make it as secondary and decrease the width. Go to color, select a solid fill and take uh, a thinner color, already it is there and make it make it transparent so that the actual graph bar also appears now select actual data series format data series let it be primary but decrease the width so that it looks like a uh, kind of mercurial within the thermometer now go to color make it solid and make it as a dark color so now it's looking very prominent and this is where basically the thermometer graph but some small problem is there if you look at the actual versus target both the places the target is 100 but actual is less than uh, target but in this graph the target the actual is showing higher in a graph so for that we need to make sure that the primary access values to be rectified so make it the maximum as one so that the graph appears properly now the graph within uh, limits and it is like showing uh, 80 and 70 kind of now this is what is a thermometer graph and we can make further prominent like uh, and further uh, more graphical do and further video discussion about it but i'm just showing you how to make this uh, graph and you can do a lot of further enhancements the way you have the imagination with you hope you understand hope you liked it thank you